For more on Ontario's vaccine passport plans, Hannah Thibodeau joins us now. And Hannah, what have we learned? Well, Ian, early next week, Ontario is expected to announce a proof of vaccine certificate, of course, commonly known as a vaccine passport. And this could be used in places like gyms, restaurants, or even movie theaters. Now, sources say the passport will be discussed at a scheduled cabinet meeting on Tuesday. And while some in the Ontario cabinet are opposed, Sources say the program will still go ahead. Other provinces are already moving forward with one, including B.C. and Quebec. They are using smartphone-based vaccine passports with a QR code that can be used in commercial and in public spaces. So Ontario, Premier Ford has repeatedly opposed uh, the idea of vaccine passports in the past. So, so what's changed? Well, as you mentioned, Ontario Premier Doug Ford has been saying it was a hard no to vaccine passports in Ontario. On July 15th, Ford said he resisted the idea because he doesn't want to split society. But there has been a lot of pressure on him recently. Local medical officers of health, as well as mayors in some of Ontario's biggest cities, even chambers of commerce have pushed for this vaccine passport. Now, sources are telling me the change is coming for many reasons. First off, public opinion is generally in favor of the passports. There are also rising case numbers of COVID-19 in Ontario and right across the country, driven by the Delta variant. And here's the last thing. Kids are heading back to school, Ian. All right, Hannah, thank you. You're quite welcome.